is Rogers TV, Toronto. Welcome back to the show. Margaret Gosis is the founder of Confident Hair, helping clients regain their confidence after losing their hair due to various illnesses. And she joins us in studio today with some hair. And you have a wonderful model, Josephine, with you. And we're going to be uh, taking a look at extensions and even eyebrow hair pieces, hair pieces, wigs, eyelashes. eyelashes. Wow. Everything. Hey, Excellent. Welcome. Thank you. Can, let's start. Uh, I was on your website yesterday. Okay. It's very informative. It's a great website. But I'm interested in how you got started with Confident Hair. Okay. My parents are actually hairdressers too. Mm -hmm. We always worked with wigs and hair pieces from day one. Yeah. And now I'm just just concentrating on wigs, hair pieces, and hair extensions, and eyebrows and eyelashes also. Is this becoming a booming business? Very much. Mm -hmm. so. It is. Well, because you know I have hair extensions. I, mm -hmm. I, one day I had short really? hair. One day I, I had short hair, and the next day I came in, it was like I had this voluptuous mane yeah. behind me, right? And I love it. When I uh, walked out of the salon with my long hair, mm -hmm. I felt so uh, feminine confident. and confident. Yeah. It changes everything. Yeah. So I think more and more women are doing that. Yeah. Not just uh, to look good, but there's some women that are going through chemotherapy that actually need to have yeah. it done. Medical reasons, hair thinning because of age. Yeah. It can be a lot of different reasons. Mm -hmm. Alopecia coming, areata alopecia. It's all different medical reasons why people yeah. are losing their hair. And I was like going to say, what about the gentleman yeah. in the crowd? Now, for yeah. me myself, here's the thing. Mm -hmm. I've always What's had really, thing, I've always had really, really big curly hair, so I've never thought I was going to lose my hair. But mm -hmm. my, are. but my mom's dad was bald. Isn't that how it goes? It's hereditary with your mom's father? Any parent. Father? It doesn't matter. Any oh, really? parent. As soon as you've got the gene, unfortunately you've got it. So any parent. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Uh -oh. I think, I don't know, I might be okay. So do men get hair pieces? Yeah. I do a lot of men. I make them natural. We do a custom hair piece. We'll take a mold of their head. It comes all technical. A mold of where they need the hair piece. I design it for them. We, d we pick the hair, a little bit of white hair, no white hair, highlights in, everything. So. I have a lot of men that have really natural looking hair pieces. Cool. Hey, are they made from real hair? Yeah, all human hey, hair. Hey, Josephine. Human hair. Yeah. Oh. Come on Josephine. in. Hi. So this is Josephine. Gorgeous yeah. lady. Yeah, oh. she's beautiful. Is she, and what is she wearing, Margaret? She's wearing one of my wigs really? that I designed for her. Josephine wow. has a little bit of thinning hair, and uh, she loves long, beautiful hair. So this is one of her wigs that we and made And this for is her. real hair? Yeah, this it's human, human hair. hair. It is. And it feels, it feels we real. Feel it. Yeah. yeah. And uh, do you wear this all day and then take it off at night? Is that how it works? Uh, yeah, I, I don't want long hair all the time. Right. I run, so I don't. I personally don't want it, so I just wear my cap. Mm. I've had thinning hair for a long time, oh, okay. so I've learned to live around that. Could you right. just turn around so. for the for the camera so sure. we can get a full view of the back too? Isn't that gorgeous? Mm. Now you can curl it and do I can anything curl that it. you would normally. Yeah, wash it, blow dry it straight, yeah. curl it, straighten it completely straight if really? I want. Mm -hmm. And how long would that last for? Probably the, about two years. The wig itself? Yeah, the yeah. wig itself. Mm -hmm. years. Two to three years, yeah. As long as I guess you keep yeah. uh, upkeep on it, it yeah. lasts for that long. Wash it and take care of it. Yes. Right. Mm -hmm. um, can I? Can we take a close look of Josephine's eyelashes? Because you've got eyelash extensions, which I think are so beautiful. Can eyelash, you tell? eyelash extensions. Yes, Margaret, <laughs> Margaret and I both have them. <laughs> eyelash extensions. Yeah. Yes. So, so strand by strand eyelash that you put in, and oh, they stay okay. in for about a month. Isn't that amazing? You can't tell. No. <laughs> and you know what? You probably don't. You don't have to wear mascara or anything. No, do you? no, you, just you don't have those? to. No. Oh my God, it'd be so much easier, isn't it? It is. It's like taking like hours off, getting it ready is. in the morning. Between the eyelashes and the and hair. hair? Do you, you have no idea how great <laughs> I, this I, is. I know. I get out of the shower and I'm like, yeah, I'm all ready. So let's, uh, Margaret, let's step through the process when okay. something like does come into your store. Okay. What would you, what would you put them through? It all depends what they're looking for. Yeah. If you have thinning hair on the top, then I'll recommend a hair piece. Okay, I will talk to you about the hair piece, how to design it. Everyone's scared of a hair piece, so I brought you some examples. Okay. A lot of my hair pieces will have a French part, meaning a natural part, it takes on your skin tone. All right? Oh, I got it. All right? Okay, right. And then we clip it on, onto your existing hair. I make it light density. This so is it's not. Isn't it? Yeah, that's a pro woman. Okay, this is fascinating because this is makes it look even more real. Yeah, it's a obviously. natural. Obviously. Yeah. Okay. Um, and then together. what else do you have? Then yeah, we okay. Like? This is another type of hair piece. This is the one that I'm wearing. You have a hair piece on too. Yeah. 
I'm wearing it my hair piece. So this is the one I wear because okay. I like more volume. Right. So this one, what I like about this one, if you want a ponytail, right. I can pull it. I make it more into the poof for a ponytail. <gasps> put your hair over, attach it, and you've got your automatic nice oh, I full, love it. like what you're doing. Right. So this I can use as a ponytail. If I tighten it or if I leave it flat, it's a hair piece like what it, I'm wearing. Would I be, someone like myself who's not like in, you know, yeah. it has no history of hair salon Yeah, this styling, a lot of ladies I, I can do that yeah. easily. So let's say you wanted to take out your hair extensions and right. take a break. This hair piece I would highly recommend. Right. You put it on, you have your length, yeah. like what I have. And if you want to wear a ponytail, you pull it a bit, you put your hair a little bit over it. And nobody would know. No. I take it off when I go to bed at That's night? That's it. That's it. Cool. I love yeah. it. What's your website, Margaret? Uh, confidenthair.com. So you can go on there and take a look at all yeah. the different hairstyles. Yeah. And we have four different kinds of hair extensions to offer. Four different kinds. Kinds. Actually, unfortunately, we've run out of time, but thanks okay. for coming in. And Josephine, thank you so much.